A lot of creators want to add audio and sound effects to their streams. Sometimes you'll find the perfect audio or the perfect sound effect, but it is within a larger audio file. So maybe it's just like five seconds of a song or three seconds of a movie clip or something like that. And what you want to do is grab that short part of the audio and put that into your stream and not the whole thing. So what we need to do is find an external software where we can grab that tiny bit of the audio from the file, create a new file of just that, and then upload it into OBS Studio to use as an audio source. So first thing you need to do, you need to go to your browser and go to audacityteam.org. Audacity is a completely free open source software. It's uh, essentially an audio editing software where you will be able to see the waveform of the track and then edit it down export it as another mp3 or wave file and then you can use it in obs studio so you're going to download audacity depending on your platform you'll choose a different download link and then once audacity is downloaded you'll see it in your applications on your device and you'll open it up and it will look a little something like this now I'm gonna need to open that audio file where our tiny bit of sound effect is that we want to cut out. So I'm gonna to go to file, I'm gonna to go to open. Uh, in this case, I've got it in my uh, folder called concerto and I'm going to import this audio file right here. And there we go, my concerto is in and we are, well, ready to have a listen. Let's put it on, let's see how loud it is. I can control the loudness with this slider up here it's actually okay it's pretty quiet right now and let's say for some particular reason i want to have let's find a little part of this that i want so it's you can see it's a one minute three minutes it's an eight minute long piece which is not really something that i want to have in my streams let's say for some reason let's find a loud part what about this part right here right i just want those strings so I've selected the part of the audio that I want to have in my stream. What we can do is we can just export that selection. So I'm gonna press file, I'm going to press export and then export selected audio. I'm going to export it into my music file on my computer, that's fine. And I'm going to call it clip for OBS. You can call it whatever you want. The type we can keep as WAV or MP3, the standard audio files. So I'm gonna go with MP3 and I'm going to click save. You can ignore all of this for now. We're just gonna click okay. And it should have exported that to my music file. So now let's go to OBS Studio. Let's go plus and we'll go to add a media source as we would for usual audio. We'll click okay. We'll go browse, we'll go to music and I should find clip for OBS. In it goes, I'm gonna have it on loop. And what I want to do is I want to monitor that so I can actually hear it right now to make sure that it's working. So we're gonna to go to properties. Oh, no, my bad, we're gonna to go to advanced audio properties and we're going to monitor that. You hear that? It's looping, it's just the strings. And loop. Perfect, there we go. And that is exactly what we wanted. We clipped out that tiny bit of audio using Audacity. Uh, let me run over exactly how we did it again. So let's go to Audacity. Let's close that. And let's go here. We're gonna go File. We're gonna go, we could go Open or Import. This time I'm gonna use the Import option, Import Audio. And we're gonna go to Concerto, Concerto right here. I'm going to select the part of the track that I want to export, or the only part that I want. I'm going to go File, Export, Export Selected Audio, that's very important. And then we're going to change the name to whatever we want. Check. I'm gonna change it to, maybe I'm gonna keep it on MP3. I'm gonna click save. Then we go to OBS Studio plus uh, media source, of course. And then you'll go to browse wherever you save the clip and choose it to put it into your OBS Studio. And that is, very, very simply, how you extract a certain part of audio from a longer audio and then put it into your OBS studio. This can be great for sound effects, for screams, for, for uh, I, I don't know, something that plays when your alert box comes up or something like that. Extract that tiny bit of audio from a longer file using Audacity and you will save yourself a heck of a lot of time.